generic greetings and welcome back to production line once again in the previous episode we got this production line up and running and indeed we tweaked it to try and make it a little bit more efficient there's still some problems with it as you can see it is insufficient resources i have messed around since then and i haven't been able to fix it the only way it would be to uh, split up the lines of and other inputs and i think we'll just leave it for now to be honest with you it's going about right we're making a car every i think it's every seven seconds one comes off the line i think that was the average for this thing and as you can see it's pretty much backed up until here anyway so there's no real issues um this is going quite well as you can see we've got three million or just over three million and we are making almost anything going on, on this line this line is such that you can make almost everything in the game if not everything the reason i'm not entirely convinced that it is actually everything is because some of the things historically in the game you need to manufacture on site now i don't know whether that is the case now but either way that's what it was previously in this episode and indeed the subsequent one i would imagine what we're going to do we were originally uh, going along the lines of maybe doing something that, um, like, produce everything on site. So, manufacture everything on site. But that's a very, very, very big amount of work that I don't think we'd be able to do at this point because we just don't have the technology. Look at all the stuff you have to build, you have to get in order to research this. So, that'll be a future us problem. But what I want to do in this one is get the hybrid powertrain and the electric powertrain and make a hybrid vehicle and make an electric vehicle and maybe stop start engine as well so we're going to max speed it out um, while we are researching we'll uh, see if we can alter this line and make it work and then what i'll do is in fact i'll do it now i'll buy this bit here and then we can have this as our electric uh, electric and hybrid area so we've got two inputs and then come around here this however is something that we might demolish this is where we've got the um, the very basic compact cars now the question is are they selling if we go to the compact um Actually, is it the compact car that we're making here? We are making the sedan B+, plus, the compact B+, plus. there's the uh, reversing camera, I'm just going to say upgrade all slots, and the sedan uh, SUV B+. Plus. Let's check those out there. Um, by the way, we'll go down to um, probably stop start engine, we'll start research rating that. Uh, so we'll go over to the cars and market, and we can see the sedan B+, plus, which is selling for customers hours 16. Sales power two, that's okay. The Savant the Sedan B plus is one, not many, and then the compact is not producing enough cars. Increased production. So we need more there. We're not saying we're not producing any at all. They're not enough for any of them. But we're selling. Well, they are selling. So actually Actually, to be honest with you, we probably no reason to get rid of it if we can do it here which i think we can because the car on here will not be like it's not going to be the tesla or anything like that or a really really high like a very very expensive premium model with everything in it it's going to be an electric vehicle so it's going to be whatever we can do to make it hybrid and and or electric it wouldn't be and or it would be hybrid or electric um and then we will add things in that we can without going too much beyond this line here. So we'll add a lot of electronics and the hybrid powertrain or the electric, but we're not going to be doing things like that because that's just insane. What we also haven't done, which I think I'll do, is uh, we've got a design studio, which we don't really need anymore because we've researched everything, but we've also got a marketing department, which I've not really bothered with. So we go over to marketing and you can see we now have the option to market something. So... If we want, we can go for, say, branded awareness campaign, print 24 hours. So it's in the print for 24 hours. So the media is print, status is ready to go. Effectiveness is 8 to 15% boost in something. Uh, 500k, so it's half a million to do. Uh, it takes 40 IDs with 180. I'm going to say launch that. And what it'll do is basically increase our market share, so we'll hopefully sell more cars. Speaking of selling cars, what I've done is because there was a lot of cars that weren't getting sold, I've reduced the price of some of our cars. So if we go over to here, you can see all these cars, apart from the very latest Sports Plus model, the Sports P, uh, which is should be premium, but it's not premium. By the way, we should also uh, go around and um, add the reversing camera into that. Even though it's still mid-range, it shouldn't be. Let's uh, check. It is mid-range, a reversing camera there. And that'll do us. I've reduced the sports p and um i uh, sorry i've kept the sports p as normal but the sedan and everything else has been reduced in cost by five uh, percent or reduced in premium by five percent that's why i've knocked that down a bit you see okay so um what's streaming in that we could connect up um well nothing really over here it's mainly these ones um if i connect these two up i don't know if it'll work there is a fit powertrain and make powertrain i'm going to upgrade fit powertrain upgrade all and we might be able to make an electric vehicle but i'm just going to go for hybrid there and that's the stop start engine so let's just check uh, see if we can get a stop start engine in this so we'll go over to actually that's a two so is this one also sorted 
fit powertrain. Yes, yeah, so this actually has a stop start engine in there. So we can put a stop start engine in these ones here. That might be quite good, actually. I'll get a little bit extra. So what we'll do, we'll go over to the the sports P because we want a stop start engine in that one. So stop start engine, there we go. Sedan P, yeah, as you can see, it's very rare as well. Very rare. Uh, so the pickup M. I think the pickup, what, what's being produced on this line? Whatever's on this line, we're going to put a stop start engine on it. Sedan M, off-road M, pickup M. Okay. So, Sedan M will have stop start engine, off-road M, and pickup M. Have stop start engine in the lot because we're getting a little boost from that. Might as well have them in. Uh, money, as you can see, flying up there. And um, once we've done the, once we've done this technology, the hybrid will make a hybrid production as well as the uh, the electric. In fact, that's fit. That's in upgrade slot fit powertrain, and that one is fit fuel tank. Uh, the problem we have now is that. There's a lot of stuff that's classed as necessity that we're going to have to make sure we have in the car, but we might not be able to fit in. So, for example, electric windows is classed as common even in budget cars, and that's in fit windows. And fit windows is a tier one, which is this. So, realistically, Realistically, is there any point in putting the... I don't think there's any point in putting the uh, a whole new line in here. Which is a bit of a shame, actually. Would have been nice to do. Would have been nice to do. Okay. How's marketing doing? Marketing is doing alright. Well, it must be because we're, cars, we're almost out of cars. We're not producing enough and we're on three and a half million. Um, see, it would be in fit powertrain, I assume. Upgrades is hybrid powertrain and electric powertrain. Yeah. So it's actually around here that we could make this. But then I really would like a line solely focused on simply doing that. Simply doing the, uh, simply doing the electric vehicles. What we'll do, we'll look at our car designs and anything with the M, off-road M. Car alarm is now universal, but we're not including a car alarm. Why are we not including the car alarm? Can we have it? I don't know. Electric windows is classed as universal. Heater and in-car music is universal. Power steering is universal. We've got all those. Sunroof universal, yes. So there's only that we have, what we have, there's a couple of things we haven't got any that we should have, really. Car alarm and electric windows. So where are those fitted? So electric windows, car alarm, yeah there it is. It's in the fit door panels and the electric windows is in fit windows. So fit doors yeah, so we need to have the th we need to have the next tier on that one. So, so that's fit doors, door panels. Yeah. So even then, that's that's the problem because this line is essentially the best line. Hmm. We have a big problem on our hands because of the tier system. Putting any electric vehicle on that. It's probably not going to work out. So what we'd have to do is build another one around here, go through and figure out what's universal, build it at least this, and then add the extra third bits on top. But then you're getting into the levels of like, well, why don't you just build, why don't you just delete all of this, and then just build a much bigger version of this. I think that's the, that's the sort of level we're at now. There's the uh, fit powertrain. 
that's the hybrid powertrain. Choose next research project, electric powertrain, then we'll select that. Or we could just go for an electric vehicle, like the cheapest electric vehicle possible. Ah, sack it. Let's just do that. Let's just go for the cheapest electric vehicle possible. Then we'll just we'll delete all of this and have the every line that does everything, um, and then manufacture it as well. So, chassis assembly. Uh, we'll put it in here. Body. Paint. Although we are going to break this down. Um, let's 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 set a minimum a minimum amount of time. Um, so that is what twelve, and the body is. 31. Can only fit two in, so it's going to have to be one there, one there. So that's going to be, with bots, about 28 seconds. 14 seconds ish, yeah, something like that. Paint is 34 seconds. So again, two of those. And then we have to fit the engine, which we have to do it separately. Um. So we'll bring it back to here. Radiator, exhaust, wheel assembly, steering wheel assembly, accessories, electronics, quality check, export. All right, there we go. So this will come out into there. This will come along. Shorted. Okay. That should be okay there. Double resource importer. And now we'll import the resources. Um, it's going to be that and that. Um, that. That should have a route to stockpile. Oh, yeah, it's just going to. Doing a typical little glitch out thing. Uh, and these. What I'll do is that. And that. And hopefully. That should be it. And we're going to pause it because we're making cars that we, we don't want to make that car. Okay, remove that line. So we don't want to produce any more cars there. But we do want to make another car. So, what we'll do, uh, what sort of hybrid do we want? What sort of hybrid do we want? Well, I'll say we've got sedans, we've got off-roads. Ideally, if you've got a hybrid, you're generally in a slightly bigger... I don't, I don't think there's... I don't think you, I think you do get compact hybrids, but really, it's your sedan level, and your. I mean, you get you get hybrids of a lot of things now, but it's generally, I believe, things like the off-road, maybe the SUV. I think the SUV is the way to go. Actually, what's selling most? That's the question. That's the question. Uh, market low for budget. Uh, we haven't got a. Budget off-road, no call. Uh, pick up budget off-road, yes. Sports, no. SUV, we do have a budget. So, actually, the SUV, a budget SUV is the way to go. So, we want to go for the SUV B+. So, create similar model. And it's going to be the SUV. SUV. It's not going to be the basic plus, it's going to be the just a hybrid. So it will have... What will it have? That's a question. Um, I'll tell you what, what I'll do, I'll work back over from here. So this upgrade, nothing. This upgrade... Um, That's the problem when you click upgrade all this is buy and then buy. So that can't have anything. This one has extra robots. Buy. This one has extra robots, which we'll just get. This one is extra robots. 
Actually, if I just buy all on this one, then we know we've done all the robots. There we go. So, predictive, predictive stock control, no. Stop, start, engine, and hybrid powertrain. Was that right? Yeah. So, stop, start, engine, buy, and hybrid powertrain, buy. So, this is going to be stop, start, engine, and a hybrid powertrain. All right. God, the price goes up immediately. Uh, for... And am I missing something? I'm sure there's a lot more upgrades on one of these. Yeah, there, that's what I'm missing. Right, so in-car music, buy. So we'll put that on. You see in alphabetical order. In-car music is in anywhere. That's fine. Uh, voice recognition and sat-nav. So... Sat nav, voice recognition is already in. Bluetooth phone is probably already in as well. Bluetooth phone, yes, it is. Okay, that's fine. Um, premium music is on research, but we should be able to get. If we get premium music, that'll be quite good. Um, okay, so there's that one. Uh, we'll work out work where this work. So, don't think there's any upgrades for paint. There isn't. No upgrades for that. No upgrades for that. Okay, so that's it. And then we'll have a premium of... Ah, see, that puts it in a mid-range. Are we selling a mid-range? Huh, got a robot army as well. Um, market. Oh, there is a... Actually, yeah, people are wanting a mid-range. There was 13 people there. Right. Yeah, even better. SUV hybrid. Boom. 30 grand mid-range. That's what we'll have. So the stuff that it doesn't have that it should, car alarm, it's universal, but we just don't have it. So we're getting, we're actually getting penalised uh, quite a bit for that. Um, and we'll see what happens when it comes out. But we're now making one. There you go. Um, actually, no, we're not because we're making the B+. So we'll, uh, we'll add the hybrid, get rid of the B+. And that's called hybrids, by the way. I will um, I will fix that because <laughs> it shouldn't be called hybrids. There we go. So it's now the hybrid and we will... Get the resource and in. And that should be it. So, um, no route to stockpile. Why you lie? Why you lie? It'll fix itself eventually. Probably after a reload, to be quite honest. It's going. No, it's definitely not. Get rid of that. Connect it back up. Get rid of that. Connect it back up. Am I missing something? That's definitely connected, right? Yeah, that's definitely connected. And so is that. Sometimes it does take a while. I'll give it I'll give it a little bit of time. I'll come back to it. In terms of place we can expand to, obviously there's only this bit left here, which is um Yeah, it has an hourly cost associated with it, so I'm not going to upgrade into that. Uh, this is broke. Get rid of that. And put the importer in. And watch it stream all to that side, but not to this side. That's very strange. Hmm. Get rid of those. Resource importer. We'll go that way. That way to there. Yeah, I don't know what's up with that. That's all kinds of broke. Hmm. Well, there's not much I can do about that. <laughs> if it's not importing. Right, so resource importer, connect that up. Connect it there first. So it should be connecting this bit. There's our fit power train. I'm going to upgrade all. And I'm going to say choose next project, and that will be 
it won't be large battery pack, it'll be premium music because that's something we can add to a lot of our other cars. As well as the touch uh, screen interface, that should have been in there as well. A uh, large battery pack requires chassis assembly specialization, which this can't do. So this is only the hybrid line then, this is only hybrids. Um, also, it's also not working at all. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to cut the episode short. Um, perhaps I don't know how long this is, but knock this on the head. Try and fix this. Next episode, build the hybrid line, and we'll probably build the hybrid line. Sorry, the uh, the electric line. We'll probably build it around here. That's probably the way to go. But we will see how we get on. As always, hope you have enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching. Take care. And this is broken.